again. Good neck. Big sheep. Oh. Beautiful red. This episode of Full Speed Fishing, we are fishing the Coral Sea out of Santa Barbara, California. This trip was a two day focusing on sea bass and halibut fishing at the Channel Islands. As mentioned, sea bass and halibut were the target, but we were just okay with pulling on fish. We're fishing the 30 to 40 feet area, like the sand flats. Uh, it's a California halibut, that's what we're looking for. These are uh, white flukes with a one ounce lead head. And we're just bouncing along the bottom, making sure it sinks on the bottom, give it a little pop pop. Letting it sink back on the bottom. Huh? Yeah! Oh. Yeah! Matt got the party started with the first legal, but John really got it going with the first big halibut of the trip. Huge shout out to John. He was able to put the biggest halibut of the morning on the boat. Uh, it was just on fire with the uh, SB baits, eight inch white fluke. He just put a smack down on some fish, uh, really for both days on it. So shout out to John for that. We spent most of the morning fishing this halibut and sea bass stuff. Sea bass weren't anywhere to be found, but the halibut sure wanted to play. After the condition started to slack off, we decided to go try our hand at some shallow water rockfish fishing that provided an excellent opportunity at Vermilion Reds and some real big sheephead. This thing is bit. Oh. It's wide open down there on fish. After about an hour of catching a mixed bag of fish, my buddy Andrew hooked something big that I thought was a big lean cod, but turned out to be even better. Andrew got that big sheep on a red rum tube bait and he made it look easy. Hell yeah. We spent about two hours in the shallows with Andrew's big sheep being the standout fish. We were able to really have a lot of fun fishing 60 to 90 feet for rockfish that wanted to bite a swim bait. We had a tank full of live squid and most guys really enjoyed using that too. After about two hours of that shallow rockfish fun, it was time to try to put some more halibut on the boat. 
Yes, sir. Nice and easy there, man. Hey, I got that. Hey! Like always, yes! Matt was the first person to hook up and put a really nice halibut on the boat on the Chubb hookup bait. About an hour later, I was throwing out the Savage Gear Dragon Tail and got hooked up. Sorry. That's a nice butt. That's a nice butt, Nick. Dude, Nick. Oh my God, get another gas. Nick. Nick! What do you got to say, Nick? I want to thank my wife. <laughs> this was the biggest halibut of my life. This fish weighed 30 pounds on the dot and pulled literally Look zero drag. It swam right up to the boat and got gaffed. Nick, is that your PB? That's my biggest, yeah. With the last well, game fish of the day, we got Fetty on a nice halibut. Finally, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. finally in the club. Let's go, dude. <laughs> right. Mike Baker was able to get the last fish of the day that concluded our day one at the Channel Islands. We finished this up with some big halibut, big sheephead, and a lot of mixed fish. This concluded day one of our two day trip. Here are some highlights of some of the big fish caught during the day. Be sure to stay tuned for day two of this two day trip as there's some absolutely epic footage. They tried to eat my weight. Got him, oh my God. Dude, we're sight fishing Johnny Bass, dude. I'm already on. I'm already on. Fishing is your game. Check out Full Speed Fishing for more.